Hey guys, welcome back to the Disney Princess Challenge with Snow White who is doing the gardening right now. Just making sure all her stuff's good, everything's weeded and being watered, which is nice because we are in summer now. We are in summer and also our two of our little googies are now uh, kitties. We have little Emma Charm here, she's currently uh, doing some chess like a smart little bean. She is also a gloomy child. Yeah, she's a gloomy child with an ancient bloodline, so that's her negative trait. But she is a little smarty bean. She is a very little smarty bean indeed. And Cinderella already just upstairs cleaning up. Already. Look how freaking cute she is. Oh no, she's got the twirlies. Oh, poor baby. She's got the twirlies. But look at those cute little freckles she got. I gave her the Cerberus freckles like Daryl. So she's going to keep the freckles as she gets older. But right now she's cleaning the... Uh, she's currently cleaning up because there's mess everywhere. She's just... Making sure everything's good. I think we have a stinky toddler. Yeah, we got a stinky toddler. Uh, when you're done, she's currently... You don't need to water the plants because everything's just been watered because of the... Uh, yeah, everything just got watered, but you can sell everything. And then we're going to make sure that we can get Mary Margaret's little nappy changed because she's been, she's a little stinky. All right, now Henry as well. Uh, I checked on him and he's actually mastered his movement. So his part of the challenge is completed. So now all we have is Mary Margaret, August, Regina and Ruby, when Ruby arrives, to do their little challenges and stuff. But we got three out of seven completed, which is nice. Which is nice. Plus little Henry's just playing with the uh, with the dollhouse right now. He's playing with the dollhouse right now. He wants to play with the nesting blocks next, I think. Yep. Snow is going to change little Babbleroo's, uh nappy and... Cinderella is cleaning up the floor whilst little uh, Hen. Oh no, that's August. There, Henry. Yeah, Henry's mastered his movement, but he's sitting on the floor right now, just playing with uh, playing with things. How are all the toddlers doing, by the way? Uh, we need one that needs to be potty trained. So Henry needs to be potty trained. Can he go by himself? No, he can't actually. All right, potty help from Snow White for now because I think he's like almost there though. Yeah, he's like 96%. He's 96% complete with the potty training skill. Little Regina's is just playing with that. And Snow's gone into labor. You can wait for now. Just potty train him first and then you can go and then you can go and have the baby. You're tired. You're, you're teething. That's not good. And who's texting you? Oh, congratulations on your recent birthday. Oh, thank you, Daryl. That's so sweet. Where does, where's Henry going? Henry, no. Snow, potty train your son because for some reason she's not, like, oh, she's not doing what I asked her to. Which is your ninth thing. Actually, before you do that, just... Okay, she's just doing things by herself. Henry, come back upstairs. Because otherwise, it's just going to be a nightmare. And right now, Cinderella's just doing homework. She's just like, I don't need to clean anything. So I can just... Okay, these two have been cute. These two have been cute. But yeah, we've got three spellcasters and three non-spellcaster children currently. Poor little uh, Regina. Just there to say, what do I do? What do I do? Because Snow just needs... Stop wanting to play with the bloody dollhouse, woman. You need to parent your children because one's slowly coming up the stairs. Wherever he is, he's now deciding to come up the stairs. I told him to come up the stairs, but they don't listen for some reason. And she's just being a little brat. It's a bit kind of chaotic, but these two just want to hug each other because they're so freaking adorable. They're just so freaking adorable for some reason. So it's now having her baby. Alright, let's get little Ruby brought into the world then. No more babies. Alright, baby girl, Ruby Charm, who will also be known as Red Riding Hood for this uh, little challenge. She's not a Disney princess, but she's a fairy tale in her own right. And it's kind of cool. If werewolves was a thing, I'd be giving her the lichen like iconic thing. Full house. Daryl has immediately come in, just be like, I heard the sounds of a baby. We have had another baby. Yes. Oh, that's great. But she is already hungry. So, time to give her foodies, and I'll just check on all the toddlers for now. Because, challenge completed, challenge completed. Challenge completed with snow now. Uh, for Mary Margaret, she just needs to go to sleep. 
Uh, communications at level four. She's getting there. She's also like 97% on the potty training as well. But once you're done, you can also go off to sleep as well. Let's go and put the uh, foodies back in the fridge for now. And again, we'll have more for snow to clean up in the near future. Yeah, because it's raining. Because she's currently sleeping. It is like 3 in the afternoon, but she is sick. So it's completely understandable. They're technically all sleeping in the wrong bed, but not a problem. Not a problem at this point. We're just sending these guys off to sleep. You're also being a little filthy beast. You can go off to sleep as well. He's just playing. No, actually, I'll just send them all off to sleep. Let's just send all the toddlers off to sleep. It gets them. It just makes them quiet for a while. Because, well, well Cinders is going to clear. Cinders is going to... I'm just going to have her get up and start cleaning everything. Well, yeah. She's just going to get up and clean. I haven't changed their clothes because there's just... There's no point in me changing clothes until they become a teenager because I don't have enough kids CC. And just, you know, some of the kids stuff isn't bad, but there's just not enough, you know. I need, like, a lot of good kids CC. I have, like, you know, the Miracle Hairs, and I have a few Simplicity Kid versions, as well as you can see as evidenced by Cinderella. But I don't have a lot of, like, I don't have a lot of clothing for kids. Like, I have lots of girls CC. I don't have enough boys stuff. I just need more custom content for kids. I don't have enough. And it's really hard to actually find it because everyone makes clothes for teenagers and adults. It's kind of unfair. Kids kind of get shafted in this game a bit because there's nobody... Like, nobody pays much attention to them. Like, we've had, like, a kid's stuff, stuff pack and a toddler stuff pack, plus parenting. I feel like that's still not enough. Alright, Cinders, how are you doing? Have you eaten? No. Oh. Uh, you haven't eaten. Have... Ooh, why don't you and Cinders have some, uh... Have some foodies together and have a little bit of a chat. Have a nice little chat, cuz. It could be nice. Nice little grown... I'll say grown-up chat. Nice little grown-up chat together. Also, don't just stand around down. You can get in on, in on this as well. Also, what even is this? What even is this song we're listening to? Let's turn that off, because it's not good. I should go to meet her new sibling. That's great. Not yeah, it's just you can meet the sibling another time. Oh yeah. You're very happy that, about the new sibling. Okay, that's good. Oh, why don't you play some chess with Daryl? Get him to do something because he's right now just standing around like a lemon. And that's not gonna be good. Okay, I think he also wanted to get food then, but why don't you guys play some chess for a bit? Cinderella's eating cake. She's eating some of the birthday cake for dinner, and Snow White's there. You guys can have a little bit of a conversation. You want to get to know your mother anyway, you guys can have a nice little conversation. Discuss your interests. And also chat about magic and Rumpelstiltskin and, you know, the fact that when Cinder's a teenager, if she wants to, she can go and live with her father and learn some magic because he lives near the magic realm. Might be useful for Cinderella as she gets older. She's going to be doing a lot of cleaning, though. She just likes all the cleaning up. She can't tend the garden, though. But when everyone's a kid, it'll be easier for Snow to look after her garden. Baby's fine right now. Thankfully. Alright, Daryl's heading off. Daryl's heading off. Uh, did you play? You got to play one game of chess with them. Snow's going to tend to the toddlers for a little bit. You also need to go off to sleep. Because you guys have school tomorrow. Right now Cinderella is basically just getting a bunch of the cleaning done. She sees it's just like, my mum works so hard. I need to help her out. Shouldn't we help her out? Emma and Emma is just like, I want to focus on school. You can help mum out all the time. I'm going to get an education. I mean, I think because, well, Emma doesn't have magic. Books is kind of all she's got right now. Who's texting Snow? Rumple von Stiltskin like to come over to hang out. Of course you can come over, Rumple Stiltskin. We need to meet with you and have a chat anyway. We need to give him back the potion because we didn't. We never needed it in the end. He might want to come and collect anyway on a. Uh, he might want to come and collect over on the. Uh, 
on the on the favor, but we don't need. And baby's also crying. Wow, can't catch a break, can you, Snow? Uh, why don't you go and invite? Why don't you do a nice friendly introduction to Rumpelstiltskin? Because you're just because right now Snow's tending to the to her toddler. She's just like Cinderella. Can you get the door, please? She's like, all right, I'll get the door. She's still got the cup in her hand. And Snow needs to, apparently she needs to pee, but she can't with a toddler in the room. But she also now needs to contend to Smelly, to little Mr. Smelly here. Something just broke. What broke? I heard the noise go off. What broke in this house? But Cinderella is <laughs> greeting Rumpelstiltskin, just being like, hello there. My name is Cinderella. My manners went up. Okay. Yeah, that bright. Okay, we can replace that. That's fine. You're dealing with the baby, but you can also boast about your family to Rumpelstiltskin and give him back the potion because you don't need it anymore. And he might be, he might just be like, well, if you did need my help, but it was nice of you to come to me for help. But if your family needs anything, dearie, don't hesitate to give me a call. So give him the friendly gift of the potion back, because you don't need it. You don't need it. You never needed it. You were you were strong and smart all on your lonesome. She's become friends with Rumpelstiltskin. Oh, that's so nice. That's very nice, but you do need to go sleep. You do need to go sleep along with all the babies. And right now, Cinderella is just taking some time. She's kind of looking after a uh, little Ruby, like sort of. Oh no, she's starting to cry. I think she might need uh, attention. So you could just quickly brief that and just try and talk to little baby sister. Because mum has gone off to sleep. Cinderella should be at school technically right now, but she kind of got sick already. So she got uh, the day off. But it's a nice sunny day. And right now she's just doing some colouring in. She's done some cleaning. She's done chores she has done her homework which is a good thing and her sister is already at school and she'll be back soon she needs to sleep and take a shower but she does also need to do her homework when she gets back Mary Margaret's actually halfway to her communication which is good because it means that she'll uh, she'll get that up soon Henry is still doing great. He's going to be aging up tomorrow with his max out movement. I kind of want like the first four kids to all have like one toddler skill, like all at level five. That way, all of these have gone through. And little August, what about you? What can you do? Oh, you got nothing to do. Play with the shapes for now. Or even better, play sim shape because that gets your thinking up. I find it weird that you can't do shapes until you get to level two. Seems kind of silly, personally. But they're all just playing right. Now, the baby's been super efficiently baby cared for. Let's do flashcards with Mary Margaret. Let's do some uh, objects flashcards. That This will help her go up. This will help her thing go up, her communication. That's not what I wanted to press. But we do have loads of birthdays all coming up. Morgan Fires wants Snow to join the Renegade. Snow is a good person. She was a, she is a paragon, not a renegade. But now that I've just thought about it, the Paragons and the Renegades is a goddamn Mass Effect reference, isn't it? Can't believe it's taken me this long to figure it out. And I don't even like the Mass Effect games. Played the first one. It was alright, but my god. That all-terrain vehicle is the worst. Oh, poor girl. He's sad. Because, oh, she made an accident. Oh, no, you're angry. Oh, yeah, because I forgot. S uh, Cinders is a hothead. <laughs> Cinders is a little hothead. But it kind of adds an interesting twist onto the story. She's also apparently the supervisor. So she'd be a great manager. She's also very happy to She was also a very happy toddler. Her manners is quite bad. But I'm going to put that up there because that's all done. Uh, sister is back. Sister can do homework. Sister can do homework and then she can take a shower and go off to bed. Uh, people are walking by. This is like quite a nice little house. 
got lots of gardening, got like, I mean, it's very bare bones, but you had to work with something before I started this. The challenge in this was kind of like a simple thing I could do. Joaquin is like, don't forget to do your skincare. Snow White, if you want to be the most beautiful in the land, you must remember that. Have you finished flashcards? Oh, nope, you're still going. Oh, they started playing now. Of course. 60. Oh, no. The toddler action broke. Oh, that's not good. You could tell the action the broke because Snow's moving around. But Mary Margaret isn't. I'm going to stop this and have her... Well, then it fixed itself. I'm going to have her just finish up her communication skills there. These guys are all just sitting, playing. Regina is looking sad. You have a potty skill now. So why don't we do some potty training? Uh, with the two that don't have potty training up to level two, yeah, which is August and Regina. That'll be a bit more useful. You're not going to smash things. Cinders, you're going... Do you need to do your homework? Nope, your homework's fine. Just go to sleep then. Head off to sleep. That might calm you down. Emma has finished her homework. She is going to take a shower and then go off to bed. Looking at Emma quickly, why does she kind of remind me of Donna from Riverdale? And if you know who I'm talking about, you might understand where I'm coming from. But she reminds me of Donna for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know why, but she's going to shower and go off to bed because she's tired, little bean. Baby has been fine all day. The baby has been super quiet all day now that Snow has got level 10 of the parenting skill. Do that super efficient baby mode. Uh, really helps. And then tomorrow we'll be aging up uh, these two into children. Which will be very useful. Means uh, less toddlers though. Less toddlers and more children. Which is good. Which is good. It means we might give them clumsy or erratic. I kind of think because... I kind of have this funny idea that because Henry was such a wild toddler, maybe he became super lazy or he became super clumsy. That kind of thing. Mary Margaret, possibly a slob or squeamish, maybe. She was a very messy child. She was a very messy toddler. Cooking and parenting is level 10. Snow has done it all. Her gardening needs to come along, but for level 7, for the amount of work she's been doing, that's not too bad. Not too bad. I think she could do with planting more things, but she can't order seed packets unless she goes to a library. Oh no, she can order them from a planter, can't she? Oh, that's even better. Oh, seasonal seeds. <gasps> seasonal seeds. Let's prepare some... Uh, let's grab a bunch of full ones. Actually, let's just grab three of each. Because I kind of want to see what we could get from the winter. And we've got... Well, we've got 14 days of summer and we've got 11 left. So we could prepare for this. We could prepare for the full ones. <laughs> right now, she's just potty training these two up to level two so they can go by themselves. He's got a long way to go, though. But he needed to be potty trained anyway. Which is very useful. How you do, Mary Margaret? Baby, you started crying. Mary Margaret is 77% complete. She's getting there. You can do it, Mary Margaret. I believe in you. I kind of have a feeling that August might also be able to get his imagination to level 5 as well. He's at level 3. And he's just been doing non-stop playing with, like, toys. Oh, uh, he's texting. Daryl wants to take Snow to the opera. That would be great, but it is very late, and we need to super efficiently baby care uh, this one. We need to replace that, and we also need to start making foodies. So let's serve some ooh, butternut nochi, butternut ganoshi. Cinderella's getting up, but immediately one of the kids just started making a mess on the floor. So she's just like... Oh, August, why? Why would you do that? We also need to... You can't clean the sink. Why can't you clean the sink? It's filthy. Hmm. Oh, well. I think that's just reserved for uh, teens and up. I think clean that up. You can uh, clean up Snow's plate for her and get some leftovers while Snow is going to go to the bathroom because she sorely needs it. I'm curious though what yeah because Regina's got like five days left 
And most of our stuff's still pretty low. I mean, we could try and... But the thing is, all of this could get to level 3. So we could try that with Regina get the Happy Toddler trait. Because these guys are almost to level 5. August is actually almost to level 5 of one of his skills. So we could do that. And then have Regina maybe get to level 3 on all her skills. Because she just has to get her thinking up to level 2. And then we can just focus on all these guys to level 3. Because Imagination's almost level 3. Movement's almost level 3. Communication, Potty and Thinking have a long way to go though. So I think we should do that. So first thing I'm going to have to do is just play Dolls to get to level 3. Then we can focus on the other skills and get her to level 3. And pretty much this challenge will be completed by the time they're all children. And then we just kind of focus on until they're teenagers and get them all A grades. That would be kind of a fun thing. Virginia's just a helpless toddler. I know she's just a helpless toddler. We're going to go and bring the foodies up in a second. Reached imagination skill level 3. Well done, Regina. Let's play with the blocks now and get your... Oh, you can't. I'll play with the stack then, just to get it up to level... To get that up to level 3. And then communication and thinking and potty can all be focused. As well, Emma needs to pee and then she and Cinderella are going to go and play some chess together. They can play some chess together mostly because you need the fun and also your aspiration. Demands it. And the babies are all just fine right now. Now with the super efficient baby care, the baby is super quiet. But also, 99%. And Mary Margaret has basically done it. And then she and her, her brother can age up. So there we go. Communication level 5. She has done it. Mary Margaret, communication level 5 written down. It's easier to write all this down because it's hard to remember half this stuff. Level 5 tick. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4 toddlers all done. Let's age up these guys next uh, in the next day. Also, I think uh, right on schedule as well. Yep, one day. So Snow is sleeping currently. Let's have her get up and start making a new cake. Let's have her make a new cake. We've done a hamburger cake for the first two. Let's do a chocolate cake for these two. So Snow is up being this like, all right, time to go and make a cake. These guys are playing some chess together. And Mary Margaret is completed her aspiration well she's got to level five of the common skills she's completed uh her challenge here and now i can send these two off downstairs so they can go and age up for their birthday and then we cc them up obviously check on most of their clothes if their clothes look all right we don't have to change them but if they look terrible we kind of have to change them so these guys are now off heading downstairs uh, you want to you want to finish eating the cake. You still have some cake on you, apparently. You apparently still had cake, so you're going to eat the cake. Sure thing, Regina. She still had some cake. But how are your things doing? Movement almost at level 3. And these guys took the tablets with them. Did they? Oh, they're going to put them downstairs, I think. Yeah, they're going to put the tablets downstairs, and then, I mean, Regina's coming downstairs as well now. But it's going to get her movement up, which is a good thing. And I think, did she win that game of chess? I think she might have. <laughs> yeah, she's a sore loser. She is a sore loser. Let's play another one then. Just to do that one. They also have to read with an adult for two hours. Right now, Snow is just waiting on the cake. These guys are like, cake time! Yay! Cake time! I'm just going to quickly pause this so Regina can quickly grab Blick Block Baby and play with that. Where are we putting the cake? Why did you put the cake there? Let's put the cake here and put some birthday candles on it. And I think Regina... Uh, Yep, so Henry can age up first. So help blow out the candles for Henry. 
and then we'll blow out the candles for Mary Margaret as well. This little this little wild child's gonna be incredibly clumsy, I think. If they can even have be clumsy. If they can't have certain traits as a kid, that's gonna kind of cause some problems. So you're gonna have the motor thing. And clumsy was Oh, can they not be clumsy? No, can he not be clumsy? No, he needs to be clumsy. I don't see it. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, no. You might have to give him lazy instead. Or tone deaf, that feels pretty negative. But you can't have clumsy children? That's so stupid. That's so stupid. Alright, I guess we'll have to change clumsy then to something else. He's just gonna have to be lazy. He was super wild as a as a kid, but now he's just super lazy despite getting the motor thing. Oh, his hair went brown. The ghost of their grandmother just gave them a present. That was very concerning. Alright, add the birthday candles again and then we'll age up Mary Margaret. Where did she go? Mary Margaret, no, come back downstairs. Ah. So we've got a lazy one. Uh, we'll have to see what other negative traits we can give them. Oh, did you get to level three of your thing? Yes, you did. Okay. Sim, shape that now. And then you'll also have to actually go about that and just quickly go up and use the potty for now. Because you need to, and we need to get your potty skill up to level three so you can get the happy toddler trait. August is actually almost a level 5 of his imagination skill, which is pretty, pretty decent. Pretty, pretty decent. Alright, let's, let's blow out the candles for Mary Margaret as well. She's very happy. And what negative trait can we give her from our list? That should work. I'm going to need to revise these rules then. I'm going to have to remove clumsy as one of the negative traits. Then... Okay, can we... If we can't use clumsy, can we have erratic or slob or squeamish? We can definitely have squeamish. And slob. But not erratic. So Mary Margaret's going to be a slob. She was a very, very, very kind of... Uh, she was a very, like, crazy kid. She was a very, like filthy child most of the time why are you wearing the I don't know why she's wearing the uh, alien outfit and also baby needs to be super efficiently cared for as well when does baby age up oh today even better super efficiently cared for her, then age her up this is perfect well it would be, she's just going to age up the kid now. Okay, so no need to efficiently solve those baby problems. These guys are coming to watch it, though. Ruby aged up. Oh, she came up blonde. That's a cute. Okay, so we have clingy, inquisitive, independent, wild, charmer, and angelic. So fussy and silly. She's going to be a silly child. <laughs> There we go. And if I'm not mistaken, yep, she is spellcaster. We've got four spellcaster kids, one of which is a boy and three non-spellcaster kids. But there we go. Bit worried that she's clipping into that. But what are you going to do? All right. So all the kids, we've got three toddlers left. We've got four children. Uh, four children, all of which that have completed their challenge. August, Regina and Ruby are the only three that have left to complete their things. Regina is going to be getting everything to level 3. August should be getting his imagination to level 5. And Ruby, we can do whatever we want with her. Perhaps get all her skills to level 3 as well. She'll have plenty of time. But alright, things are going pretty well now. I'm going to go and put the uh, cake away.
in the fridge. And I think we should end this episode here because we've done pretty well for this one. So thank you guys so much for watching this challenge. All we got to do is get three more of the kids to finish off their uh, traits, uh, finish off their challenges. And then we could be moving on to Cinderella's story, part of the challenge. But Cinderella also has to, uh, I'd say, become an A student. We've got to get her up to a teenager first. So there's going to be like a period of time where it's just going to be them all being kids for like a while and then we'll probably skip through that maybe to the end of it where they can all age up into teenagers then move into uh the cinderella part of the generation challenge because we'll have most of the challenges completed by then but getting the challenge completed is the main thing so thank you guys so much for watching i'll see y'all in the next video bye bye now